In this course, we will cover how to design database and implement in SQL Server. Everything about working with databases, we will cover different scenarios of database and by the end we will be creating this. Everything about HTML, CSS and Bootstrap and by the end of this section we will be creating this. Everything about c -sharp, Object Oriented Programming, Programming Fundamentals, Entry Framework and ASP.NET Core and by the end of this session we will be creating this. We will master ASP.NET Core basics, difference between controllers, models and views, working with single model or multiple models. We will cover form elements like text box, radio buttons, check boxes, drop down list and others. Upload and store single image or single PDF and how to upload multiple images and multiple PDFs. And by the end we will be creating this client-side validation and server-side validation, how to perform crude operations using entry framework core and store procedures. We will cover how to pass multiple models to one store procedure and perform in databases. We will cover all concepts of security and how can we secure our website by using ASP.NET Identity, Register, Login and Logout concepts. We will cover everything about jQuery and Ajax request and by the end we will create single page CRUD operation. In the next section we will add jQuery data tables, basic steps to add data tables and how many parameters we need to use while working with client side and server side processing. We will add bootstrap labels, images, icons and buttons. We will implement client side and server side searching, sorting and pagination in our data table. In the last section we will cover RDLC reports, how to install and add RDLC report in your ASP.NET Core application. Everything about report design, size, its parameters, images, report path and data sources. And then we will learn how to display report on next tab and how to add download functionality in your reports. In the bonus section, I will show you how to create a developer resume, how to make it more professional, how many sections you need to add, how much experience and projects you need to add in your resume. Then I will teach you how to find development jobs online, how to prepare your interview, how many questions you need to prepare for a good interview and how to negotiate more salary. You will learn this and thousand more details and concepts of web development.